Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I am super excited to go over this ultra clean 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L. This is a Laredo with the Altitude package. It is stock number 14891Z. I'm here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee headquarters. In fact, we have one of the largest selections of Jeep Grand Cherokees in the state of Wisconsin, new and used. So go check us out at summitauto.com. This one has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine, 293 horsepower, and it's paired up with the eight speed automatic transmission. This Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this Jeep is 100% ready to go. This is a one, one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Michigan. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. Inside, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options, and give you the most accurate representation that I can of this Jeep. Baltic gray metallic is color paint code is PAS. I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, and have access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and Jeep Grand Cherokee walkarounds on YouTube, and stay current and up to date on our ever-changing and vast Jeep Grand Cherokee inventory, so you do not miss out on gems like this one. Comes with the 20 inch gloss black painted alloy wheels. That's part of the altitude package. Has Bridgestone Dueler HL tires. These are 26550 R20s. I would say that they have probably about 70% of the tread left on them. Front fender is in excellent condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. Does have the LED running lights and the LED fog lamps. I will turn those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. Front bumper's in fantastic condition, no dents, stings, scuffs, or scrapes on there. Do note you get the gloss black on the lower part of the bumper as well as around the grill there, the seven slotted grill. And you also get the gloss black Jeep lettering. That's all part of that altitude package. The hood is in fantastic condition. I didn't see any dents or dings on there. And the passenger side front fender, really nice shape as well. Passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. That looks really good. And Baltic gray, it's got a lot of metal flake in it. Got some blues, some purples, and even some turquoise and greens in there. Definitely a neat color. It's a little bit lighter than the old granite crystal and looks really good. You can see just how nice that paint is as well. And as you go down this side of this 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L Altitude, take note of how clean that body is. I didn't see any dents, I didn't see any dings, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I didn't see any scuffs or scratches. And the, hood, the roof is in nice shape. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away or even if close by, and you just can't make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the Jeep, hear the Jeep and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, rear quarter looks great. It does have the LED tail lamps. We'll turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are and how they look. The rear bumper is in great shape. It does have the backup parking sensors, no scuffs or scrapes back here. And it does have the power lift gate. You also get the gloss black Jeep lettering and the gloss black above the lights there. Back storage area is very nice and clean. These third row seats do fold down nice and flat and you can see they go down like so. You also have a USB and USB-C back here. And then you get the silhouettes of the Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee L in the window. These go back just like so. You also have a 12 volt power point back here, a couple little storage cubbies, and you also have your power gate button there. There is storage back here with uh, access to your jack tools and to get your spare tire down. Press this button, it'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. And you can see that's working nicely. You also get the L and four by four blacked out as well, part of the altitude package. And coming around the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no major dents or dings on the rear quarter or door. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is just as nice as the rest. You do get the capless fuel fill, which is a nice feature. Never get gas on your hands again. And you get the little Jeep logo there, little Easter egg. 
Coming down the rest of the side of the car, doors look really good. You get the gloss black Grand Cherokee and American flag lettering there. Has the heated power mirrors, blind spot monitoring, built-in directional signals, has the enter and go system. Just have to have the key fob in your pocket, it'll automatically unlock. Let's take a look at the back seats, second row. Quad seating, you get the suede and leatherette seats. No rips, no tears on them. You get the white stitching on there as well. Factory floor mats, carpeting's in nice shape. You get the rear air controls, as well as two USBs, two USB-Cs, and a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. And two cup holders back here to get to that third row. Just lift up on this handle here, and that slides forward like so to get to that third row seats. No rips or tears back there, they look really good. And you do get a cup holder, USB and USB-C on that side as well. You can see these seats do adjust like so. Get this granite crystal trim on the door. That's pretty cool and that's actually metal flakes so that Sparkles a little bit. Get the child safety locks in the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look fantastic. Up front, you get these same suede and leatherette bucket seats. No rips, no tears on these seats. They're in really nice condition. No stains, look really good. Both of these front seats are heated. You get a power driver seat with lumbar, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, and you get that granite crystal trim on the dash and door, power windows, locks, and mirrors as well. Let's hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything this one has to offer on the interior. You can see this one has 17,635 miles. You get the 10.25 inch LCD display, compass, and range to empty, as well as the digital speedometer on here. And uh, instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Comes with the heated leather wrap steering wheel. On the right, you have cruise controls and adaptive cruise controls. On the left, you have Bluetooth and information center controls, and then you can change to the different um, screens, I guess you could say, the five screens there. And, uh, Audio controls in the back of the steering wheel, as well as paddle shifters for sport, sport mode. You get start-stop capabilities, lane departure, stability control, hazard lights, parking sensors, and there is sport mode, push-button start. This one has the Uconnect 5, 5 um, 5-seat radio, and uh, has AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You also get your climate controls here, which includes the dual climate controls. Let's see if we can get those on here. There's your dual climate controls. You get heated seats, heated steering wheel buttons. You also have AM, FM, and Sirius. You get your home screen here. And then you can also check out your cameras. So check out that backup camera here. You can see they made that HD crystal clear and you can zoom in over the back in case you put a hitch on this vehicle. This one does not have a hitch, but if you put one on, you'd be all set up to tow. And here are all your different apps. A lot of this stuff is just links to different parts of the radio. This one also has Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. They are wireless on the Uconnect 5 system. Down here, your more tactile volume tune and climate controls, your heated seat and heated steering wheel buttons, two USBs, two USB-Cs and an AUX jack, and the wireless cell phone charge pad. Here's your eight-speed automatic transmission. You get a nice spot for your key fob here, keyless entry with remote start and power lift gate buttons on there. And the passenger side dash, floor mat, and seat are all in excellent condition as well. I don't think it's ever been smoked in in here. Smells very clean and the headliner is in great shape. You do get map lights right there, assist and SOS buttons, as well as your power lift gate button and an auto dimming mirror. Windshield is in fantastic shape. I didn't see any chips or cracks on that. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood and check out all those LED lights. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that other than my hood's open. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. Hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this Jeep all the way around inside and out. 
and hopefully you enjoyed the video as well. Try to make these as digestible as possible. And under the hood, we have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. These are typically rated to get 25 highway, 18 city, and 21 average. Um, 293 horsepower. And once again, this Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. There is the emissions sticker. The shocks are doing a fantastic job holding that hood up. And you can see all those lights are working nicely. I would highly recommend this Jeep Grand Cherokee from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship it back to Michigan, California, Texas, New York, Florida. Whoever is going to get this vehicle is going to be very happy with it. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Grand Cherokees, Grand Cherokee L's, Grand Wagoneers, Wagoneers, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to the largest catalog of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube or close to the largest. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Grand Cherokee videos I've ever done in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we are super excited to be offering this ultra clean 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee L Altitude in Baltic Gray Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again, and have a great day.